Greetings, my friends. Today I am standing in Resurrection's Memorial Garden because I want to be surrounded by the saints of Resurrection Past who by their historical testimony generously shared their resources to sustain Jesus' ministry right here in beautiful downtown Salty, Nacoochee, Georgia. And in addition to all of these Resurrection Saints, we have also lost six of our members in just seven short months. They served Resurrection faithfully and they gave so generously so that we could be the hands and feet of Jesus in White County. And now we are inheritors of their great cloud of witness. And we are so thankful that they have entrusted Resurrection's continuing ministry and future to all of us. What a sacred responsibility we all now share. You know, when 2020 began, Resurrection's mission and ministry was just coming off one of the best years that we have ever had. And our pledges for the 2020 budget were better than they had been in years. But none of us could have predicted, none of us could have known what this year would be like. And I don't have to remind you of all the disruptions and the losses and the anxieties that this year has brought, not only to our parish, but to our community, because we're all still living with the impacts. I can say, however, that although the coronavirus pandemic has tested our resolve, it has not tested our faith. We are stronger and more resilient than we have ever been as a church and as a community of neighbors. So thank you. Thanks to each one of you for doing your part in your homes and in your workplaces, in the schools, in the neighborhoods, in your families, and right here in this parish church. Our stewardship and our mission for this year has been focused on service. Our church has never been closed, but we have experienced several months of not being able to gather in person. The usual focus on weekly worship was spread throughout the week as we found ways to gather virtually, taking more time to pray for each other's needs and to serve our, our communities. You use this time to discover, to enhance, and put to use the gifts that you have received from our Creator God, and you have used them to serve each other. And I have witnessed the countless ways in which you have used your resources for the mission of the church and to help each other. And I have personally found it so inspiring and hopeful as we plan for our work together for 2021. So this coming year, we will explore the way that our generosity is inspired by our faith and how we are formed and led into relationship with each other as we share our gifts with the world. That's what is meant by faith-filled generosity. So how will you discover and use the gifts you have been given to help the church next year? How will you hear the gospel call to seek and serve Christ and all people and respond with generosity? As I look at each family and each individual in our parish community, I realize that we are stewards of God's abundant grace because we give to the world from that which we have received. And so this year, your vestry will be contacting you to invite you to participate. And I invite you to join with me and Patty to receive this invitation with grace and prayer as you consider how you will share with God and God's church from what you have so faithfully and abundantly received. And so again, thank you. And please know that I love you and I am proud to be your priest. God bless you.